Hello everyone, welcome to Dan Desktop Support. Um, before I start on a new basic training course, I just want to share you guys that I made a new site that's called hotfindtoday.com. And in this site, basically, every day I will share one freeware that is you can it can be used for many other things like freeware, recent software finds, free online courses, short tips, times limited deals, and other interesting things. So. If, uh, make sure you get subscribed to this site uh, every day you will get an email if you do RSS or you just want to come to the site you will see something new that can be very useful to you so what are we going to do today we are going to go over a new um, Microsoft email service that is called Outlook.com okay so Outlook.com what is Outlook com is a powerful free email with security from Microsoft and does live home as the best class e services blah 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 what what is what is this this basically means outlook is kind of like combining every single thing for simple users I mean documents management um, other services like Facebook contacts your Gmail contacts everything can be shared in one place now we're gonna do a very basic setup for a normal user this is not going to be something very technical this is going to show you how to make an Outlook address and then how how do you use it so we're just gonna start simple you go to google.com and then click on Outlook and here just click on this Outlook so once you see that look at it a little bit so then you can see the whole screen uh, Right, so here you will see this uh, Outlook welcome screen in there. So first thing you want to do is click on the sign up now, or on the left side. You can click right here. You will get this, and I'm going to put this information, and then I'm going to click on next. So you guys can do this, and I'm going to click next after this. Don't want to show this information online, so. I'm going to fill this out and click and then I'll come back here and I'll click on accept which is right here okay it's right here accept and then I'm gonna join you guys back again where I will be inside the email address okay alright so once you accept you'll see this new welcome inbox in your uh, email address that mean you're you successfully uh, created your account now you can basically come back and uh, you can go through this but I'm gonna go through all the setups and little things that um, you can benefit from this email address first thing you notice on the left side it's pretty nice um, it looks like they made it the way like Windows 8 and Windows Server 2008 is going to be everything is like the whole tab and everything looks the same so they're basically using all the same theme in all all these um, operating systems and trying to make things look like the same you know so it's pretty cool how is going to be this email is going to look if you click on the email it's in the middle and you can see it's very simple very easy um, what are some options here so basically to reply to the emails on the top these links right here you can create a new email here if you click right here you can see you can type in the email address and type in this area and just to let you know that this is still in a they're still developing this so it's not like a full version but it looks like almost almost done there like they probably might be pushing it out pretty soon so it's better to put your hands on and get the email address that you want I would recommend you guys to get your emails right now um, because of the names like if I want my full name or anything you will have more availability because once it's out then a lot of people will be joining in and you won't be able to find what you exactly you, what, what you want exactly so these are some uh, some basic stuff here you can uh, play around with here like you can add Facebook add people to ch chat with that's another option you can do that um, you can change the colors so if I want 
blue you can take this and you can change here the whole setup for this it's like a, a very um, nice way like and you can go to more settings send receiving even some other accounts and you can do all these setups here um, whatever you like so this is basically the email part of it uh, if you're gonna go back click on outlook again and it will go you'll go back to the main screen um, that is basically the basic stuff what's cool about this one is that you can um, you can go back here and you see this little tab arrow the down arrow you can click on that and you will see some other stuff now mail is where we are right now people you can click on people and then it will drop down now you can add your Facebook friends you can add Google contacts you can add LinkedIn you can add Twitter you can even import from Outlook which is basically the main Outlook that you use restore deleted uh, contact that is another great option um, if you for some reason um, things get deleted you have now a way to do that so you have a restore point into this uh, that's a pretty cool option in there um, let's go back here let's go back to people and see what other, other things we have manage we can clean up contacts we can manage groups we can invite on messengers, we can addition and limit access. Limit access is very good in the one that you can uh, use for limiting all that. Uh, you can create here another contact, fresh contacts. I'm just create now. So if you go back now, let's go back to another one. Let's go back to calendar. How the calendar will look. Very uh, nice calendar look. It basically looks like the same as a. Uh, Outlook, um, uh, the one that we use in business environments or for like small businesses, and this is very nice. They have everything inside this. Um, so let's go back now. This whole email, and then we come back here, and then click on the SkyDrive. That's one of the best options that I think this will be used for. You can now basically do all the documents online so SkyDrive I'm not sure how much GB they will give you 7 GB right here sorry it used to be 25 when when I started like a few years ago but now it's 7 GB so but still you can use this 7 GB for re for great purposes like you can do online you can create a word online without having a word Microsoft Word with you so that's another great option that you have so if you click on word they say I want to make a test document and create so online basically everything is online right now you can make a you can make anything like you can type in anything and then you can save it and what's gonna happen it's gonna automatically save it on your sky drive and let's see where it's saved I want to see where it's going to save it's right here um, this is you can move this wherever you want to, um, but that's another option. You can add file, you can add another folder. I mean, here you can just do like your documentation and all that, and it will be saved here. Very great option, and you can you can use uh what what do you have Excel? You can have PowerPoint and one notebook, and so that's pretty cool. Photos, you can add your photos over here. And uh, you can add another computer over here. That's that's another option. To add a computer, you will need to first install SkyDrive on your Windows on it. So let's say if you want to sync some documents to uh, the SkyDrive, and then you can you add another computer. What's going to happen? Your files are going to be synced on this same uh, email address, and you can use it right here. So for example, if you have three computers at home, you can install SkyDrive on it and sync all these files the same place um, that's another awesome option so um, if you go back here this is this is basically going back to the hotmail address which is going to change what I'm think I'm thinking it's going to change um, so that's basically it from outlook.com um, I liked it pretty much I mean it's pretty nice there's the way it's very simple the whole simplicity is the best thing so um, that's it I guess there's nothing else to do 
in this video other thing uh, to remember on uh, the site I'm gonna be posting this video on the fine hot so if you go to hotfindtoday.com you will see this link um, posted over here in the video with it so go ahead take a look at outlook.com create a new email address and enjoy the free services alright this is from Dan Desktop Support take care have fun bye bye